when I look at the, the possible destinations, and look, the Lakers, I, like no one has mentioned, and again, we're throwing out everybody's name, AD and AD for like for 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 mm. Kevin Durant. I think to me that sounds if for you're Durant. like for Durant. Durant. Now Durant. Now I also now when I look at Kyrie. Now Kyrie's talking about wanting to go to LA. That that's been the 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 rumor mill and all this other stuff. And you're right, Russell Westbrook. And if you can if you can just kind of swap that and just say, hey, we want to move on. Then you you know you take on that contract and you get some picks, like. I, like, because if, if you're talking about a buyout, like we talked about there, because you, we don't believe he's going to be in a Brooklyn Nets uniform next year, so you're talking about a buyout, so you're just going to cost money for nothing. Look, say what you want about Russ. Say what you want about Russ. Russ shows up every day to work. Sure Absolutely. Show, Russ shows up every single day. To, you don't question his effort. You don't question his durability. <clears throat> my question is shot selection. You might collect, like, you might question some other things, but you don't question his availability. You don't yep. question him showing up. And, an Ironman. He's an Ironman. And so, you know, when you look at this, I could see, I could see Kyrie. You know, I could see Kyrie getting to LA sooner than people think if if that's what the Nets do because I think a lot of places Kyrie we make it seem like Kyrie just gonna want to show up someplace and like hey we're sending you to Oklahoma City for some picks and they're gonna like, yeah, no. then he's gonna get bought out and he's gonna go to LA so it's like I think Kyrie Irving high probability ends the season in LA yeah I mean we and and that's true we could we all speculate that Kyrie could possibly end up in LA but guess who else could end up in LA Kevin Durant, and here's why I feel this way, right? When you look at the Clippers and you look at Kawhi Leonard, I want you to go back before Kawhi Leonard signed with the Clippers. He was on the phone begging Kevin Durant to pair up with him and go join the L.A. Clippers before he got on the phone and, and, and you know, somewhat went behind <laughs> Russ back and told Paul George to leave and asked to be traded to go to the Clippers. So I wouldn't, Why I mean. Why did go I'm, behind Russ's back? Because, man, you know what I'm saying? It was, listen, it was some conversations being held. I ain't. We don't got to get into it, but I, okay, I just, but I'm say, just how do you go behind Russ's back uh, because, to talk to another because, about what he wants? Because they was already in conversations with one another before he went to Paul George. He was in conversations with Russ. That's another story. Anyway. What I'm saying is be on the lookout, be on the lookout possibly for a Paul George uh, KD swap. Now listen, I'm not putting anything past Kawhi Leonard when it comes down to him trying to win and him trying to think about himself and what he could do for an organization. And we are talking about Kevin Durant. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.